Hello and welcome back to another video. Today I'll be drawing the character Zhongli from Genshin Impact, so I hope you'll enjoy this video. I've made some Genshin Impact fan art before. I think I've drawn Amber and Venti. I think they're the only characters I've drawn so far. And I've, I've been playing a lot of Genshin Impact lately, so I thought it'd be fun to make sort of like a Genshin Impact series where I draw, um, well, I'm gonna try to draw all the characters but in like little squares. So they're not like overwhelmingly like intense drawings, if that makes any sense. Not very big drawings, just little, I mean, they're not little, but just, just squares, little portraits of each character. I'm actually still all out of marker paper. I've been all out of marker paper for the past like two or three weeks now. I've been waiting for more to arrive in the mail, but it's got a, it's got a ship from England and I live in Norway and I think there's still a huge delay because at first the virus and second of all Christmas and yeah it's just taking forever for it to arrive here and I, the, the first time I tried to order it um I got a refund for some reason I don't know why so I had to buy it again like a week later it's supposed to arrive sometime between now and the 15th of February but somehow I doubt that <laughs> so who knows when, when it'll arrive if it'll arrive so it was driving me insane so I just I just had to start drawing again i had to use my markers so i used my mixed media paper i really i really only use that for watercolor and for gouache but it was driving me insane not using my markers so i was like what the hell markers will work so yeah it was a bit of a challenge though because i'm not used to using markers for this paper and it's really like it's like grainy paper it's a bit thicker because you know it's supposed to hold a lot of water and because of that at least for the darker areas, um, ended up looking very like, very grainy, very like spotty. So I will go, you will see at the end of this video that I go in um, and procreate and fix some things up. Try my best to make it look a little less grainy. So yeah. <laughs> and I also struggled a lot with this drawing because um, it kind of feels like all my markers just stopped working all at once. <laughs> Um, they've, or at least half of them, if not more, need refills, and they've been needing refills for quite a while now, but I've been putting it off because it, you know, it costs money. <laughs> so, you know, I've kind of been like, okay, I'll just, I'll wait a little longer. I'll just use other markers. And I did that for so long that, like, like, half of them are dead now. So, yeah, my, the colors that I actually can use, um not a lot of them <laughs> i was pretty happy with the sketch because um zhongli is my favorite character in Genshin impact and he's beautiful so the entire time i was sketching him i was like oh my gosh that is one beautiful man <laughs> yeah I, w I really enjoyed his hair um hair is always my favorite part to color in so it was fun doing that again so the blues that i needed for like the collar of a shirt um those were all broken all of them were either dead or just just wouldn't work so you'll see at the end of this video again that i go in and procreate to fix it up because i had to tweak the colors of the collar a little bit so yeah i also made his hair a little darker and um procreate because i ended up making his hair look very very brown and his hair is more it honestly looks more black but then it fades to like a brown kind of like caramelly is that, is that even a word more like a caramel brown to the tips I would recommend watching either my amber or my venti speed paint or videos <laughs> because I've already explained what Genshin Impact is about and why I love it so much so I don't I don't really want to repeat myself again <laughs> but long story short Genshin Impact is a game that is for just about all platforms except for the switch and it's it's kind of been big these past few months. I mean, I thought it was gonna people were gonna forget about it after like a month or two, but it's it's still going strong, and I'm I'm very happy about that because I do really like Genshin Impact, and I love going through Instagram and seeing nothing but like tons of fan art of Genshin Impact. But yeah, every time I think it's gonna die out, um, there's a new like character event. Like Zhongli really brought <laughs> the fans back, and now Xiao is making everyone go crazy so yeah <laughs> i'm d i'm very glad that it's 
still going strong. But yeah, basically it's it's like it's Breath of the Wild meets anime and it's amazing. So I would recommend go playing it. <laughs> Most characters in the game, and not just characters, but like places and like different objects and things that have I, I think they've gotten inspired by uh, Germany, <laughs> at least from Mondstadt. I think that has a lot of like German influence. And then we have Li Wei, which I believe has a lot of Chinese influence. Um, so I'm probably pronouncing a, like everything wrong at this point, and I believe that I'm even saying Zhongli's name wrong because even though it's spelled like Zhongli, I think it's actually like I think it's like a ch sound, not a Z sound, you know. So yeah, I'm sorry. I'm probably butchering everyone's names, but I'm just gonna keep saying it like this because <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce any of it. But yeah, Zhongli. Um, he was the new character, not for the, not for this event, not for the last event, but for the event before that. And he's a five-star character. And yeah, I got, I got extremely lucky because I had, I had some of those, like, wish thingies. Because to get new characters in Genshin Impact, you gotta use Primo Gems to buy these, like, wish thingies. And then you can, like... And then you get these different things, and if you're lucky, you'll get a you'll get a new character, and that's how you get new characters in the game. And if you're extremely lucky, then you'll get a five star character during um, you know during one of these events where you can when that's the only time you can get the the limited five star characters. And you know I had enough of those wish thingies, so I thought you know I'll just like I'll just buy another pack. Why not? And all of a sudden Zhang Li was up on my screen, and I was like. Oh my god, it happened. <laughs> like, I was not expecting it, but it was a pleasant surprise, and I I freaking love him. Like, my favorite characters... No, wait, 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 wait. I think the Albedo event was also after Zhongli. Okay, so it was not... It's not this event, it's not the last event, and it wasn't the event before that. But then, it was Zhongli's event. <laughs> so, it was quite a while ago, actually. Anyway, uh, my favorite characters... Um, well, first place is gonna have to be Zhongli. I just freaking love him. Um, he kind of reminds me of like all my favorite characters. Like, I don't know. He kind of gives off like kind of like Juman vibes from Mystic Messenger. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I think Zhong or I I know Zhong Li is my favorite character, and then it's gonna be Albedo. So I am still extremely heartbroken that I didn't get him for his event because I tried so hard. But whatever. Hopefully there'll be like. I don't know, some kind of event in the future where they can bring back limited um, characters for those of us that, you know, didn't have good luck. Because <laughs> I really want Albedo, I really like him. So anyway, Zhongli, Albedo, and then Venti. Um, and then, I mean, I like everyone, but I think after that it might be like Yan Yu. Maybe, maybe Klee? Or Kaya? Yeah, I love everyone. <laughs> but, yeah... I didn't really care that much for, for Ganyu because she uses a bow and I was like, you know what, I have my amber, I don't really want any other <laughs> bow users. But now that I lost my chance to get her, I kind of want her because <laughs> I didn't do her story quest thing until I believe I did it yesterday or the day before that. And then I was like, damn, I kind of love her. <laughs> like, she's just, she's so wonderful. And then I had to fight as her as well for that quest and then I was like, I regret everything. <laughs> I really want her now. But, oh well. <laughs> Hopefully I'll be lucky, lucky enough to get Chao. Um, by the way, I don't know if you could say that I have really good luck or really bad luck, but I've gotten two five-star characters <laughs> in the past, like, three days. Because I got Zhongli, but he was the first five-star character I ever got. And, um, for, I think it was the day that Xiao came out. I ended up with a 5 star character, but it wasn't him. <laughs> I got uh, Diluc, and I am glad for getting him, but I would have liked to get a limited <laughs> a limited 5 star character before, you know, my time runs out. And then the day after that, I got Jean. <laughs> so, yeah. I am glad that I finally have some 5 star characters now, but I would have liked Xiao. <laughs> and I honestly don't have all that much to say about Zhongli, because I don't know that much about him. And the things I do know about him could could be seen as kind of spoilery, so I won't say it. <laughs> um, so, 
yeah, I don't really have anything else to say about Zhongli, just that I just love him more and more over time. I don't really know why, it just it just kind of happens. <laughs> and he he was just suddenly my favorite character because it was it was venti for the longest time. And then Zhongli just like silently and so slowly just kind of took over and all of a sudden he was my favorite. And I didn't understand how or why. <laughs> but yeah, Zhongli. And then comes Albedo because I freaking love Albedo and I'm so sad that I don't have him. Anyway, I wish the best of luck to everyone who's trying to get shower right now. <laughs> and that's really everything I had to say about Getchen Impact and Zhongli and this drawing, so... I haven't done this in like two or three weeks, so let's talk about my current art project. First of all, I already mentioned that I wanted to start this series with Genshin Impact characters in these little squares, like this Zhongli drawing. So I, I have actually already finished um, a drawing of Child or Tartaglio. Um, so he'll probably be the next character that I draw. And I think after that I'm going to try to do like Xiao and Ganyu or something. Or maybe I'll just go with Lumine and Aether. I don't know. I think it's going to be Xiao and Ganyu since that's kind of fitting since it's Xiao's event at the moment. So yeah, I'm going to work on that. Hopefully my marker paper will, will arrive and hopefully my markers will hold out. Mm, otherwise, the only thing I really have planned is that um, Haikyuu series that I'm working on. Because um, I finished the four like main Karasuno dudes. <laughs> so I kind of want to... I mean, there are more Karasuno characters that I'd like to draw, but I think I want to move away from Karasuno for a little bit. And I think Oik or I I don't think I know I know Oikawa will be my next character that I draw for that and then otherwise I don't have anything like set in stone but I know I know I want to draw like Kuro and Kenma and Bokuto and Akashi and maybe Tendo and uh the twin what's, what's her name Atsumu and Osumu is that his name can't remember and then eventually I'll get to like. Nishinoya and Tanaka and Suga and maybe I'll even get to some females as well. There's not a lot of females, but yeah, so that's all I have planned. I mean, there are some characters that have birthdays in February that I wouldn't mind drawing, but I don't have anything planned. <laughs> so yeah, Genshin Impact um, series and uh, my Haikyuu series, I guess. <laughs> to what I've been up to lately. Um, you know, besides drawing, um, I've been playing a lot of Genshin Impact, like, I'm really getting into it again, or I never got out of it. <laughs> I've been playing it, like, non-stop for quite a while now, but, like, now, now I'm really going all, that, all, all out because I really want Xiao. So, yeah, I'm playing a butt ton of that. Um, and then, you know, school. <laughs> um, otherwise, um two different fandoms that I've been in lately. Um, I started re-watching Violet Evergarden with my sister and I saw that while it was airing back in 2018. So it's it's been a while since I've seen it and I couldn't really remember anything except for the fact that it's really good. So I rewatched it, I cried. <laughs> uh, it's really good so if you like more emotional, not, not necessarily emotional but more like more like touching and beautiful shows, then I definitely recommend Violet Evergarden. And I think I should draw Violet Evergarden. Um, what was my sister and I watching? Huh. After we finished Hunter Hunter, I can't remember if we watched anything. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we finished your uh, Yuri on Ice. And now we're working on ReZero. Because my sister has seen it before, but it was years ago. So she wanted to, you know, watch it again before she continues with season two. And if you've been keeping up with my channel for a while, or if you know anything about me, then you know that I absolutely freaking love Ray Zero. So this is my fourth time watching it. <laughs> and I never get sick of it. I The last time I watched it was actually last summer because I had to rewatch it before season two started airing. And I was, or I was keeping up with season two, but I don't know. I couldn't take waiting a week with each episode, so I kind of just gave up. 
after six episodes <laughs> so i actually haven't seen anything past those six episodes in season two i think there's 12 episodes 12 or 13 and season two part two is actually airing right now so before i get something spoiled for me i would like to catch up <laughs> so that's what we're working on at the moment so yeah that's really everything that was worth mentioning um i apologize if i sound kind of sick i was i did not sound like this like an hour ago or even uh 20 minutes ago this happened right before i started filming so i don't <sighs> it's so infuriating it happens every single time so i'm sorry that i've sounded like this throughout the entire video i think the universe is just out to get me sometimes but yeah i hope you guys have had a nice week and i hope that you guys will continue to have a nice week even though it's basically over by the time this video comes out um let me know who, who your favorite genshin impact character is i'm actually really curious um and yeah oh and please let me know which genshin impact character you'd like me to draw next i mean next will be child but like after that <laughs> thank you for watching this video and i'll see you guys next sunday